everyone, I'm Juliana Ferreiro and this is Sneak Peek. Today we're at the Pompano Beach Cultural Center for Lines of Expression. Lines of Expression celebrates the creative force of Latin American geometric abstraction with an exhibition featuring paintings, sculptures, and prints by six South Florida artists. Featuring abstract and colorful paintings from Morela Vilan, Magdali Montenegro, and Marianela Perez, and intrinsic sculptures from Saul Galaviz, Wilfredo Soto, and Diana Font. What I really enjoy about this exhibition is that it requires movement on part of the viewer as well. So I want to spend some time talking about this uh, painting, Lunar 12 by Morela Vilan. On first sight, you will see a green circle on a blue wall. But as you spend more time with the piece, you you're start noticing the different nuances in it. So if we start looking at a piece from the distance, you will see the green, as, we, as I just mentioned. As you get closer and you spend time looking at it, you start seeing the different colors in her brush strokes and the movement that her body had to take when she was creating the piece. So there's green brush strokes, but there are different tonalities of green. There's golden brush strokes, but there's different tonalities and they go going in different directions. And the more you look at it, you will also see that there's some sort of movement going around. So if you're spending time looking at this, my first time looking at it, to me it inspired me of um, green tall grass in a prairie and it was moving with the wind. What do you see? When I organized the exhibitions at the Pompano Beach Cultural Center, I tried to find relationships between them. In this case, I found that these collages by Marianela Perez relate beautifully with the exhibition Unfamiliar Ground by Missy Pierce. In the pieces that I'm showing you, you can see that Marianela is starting with a new style. She's exploring with collage, which relates very much to Missy Pierce. And she's still very true through her diagonals and very true through her color scheme and a lot, there's a lot of color and vibrancy. But in this case, because these, ex, these uh, pieces were made during the pandemic in 2020, there is a lot more introspection. You see more of the text and because of the text, she finds the titles in the pieces. So this one is sensitive and this one is creative you will see that the colors have more transparency, but still there is the diagonals in her pieces. And very subtle, you see a face, which will be the face of the artist. This exhibition features artworks that follow geometric abstraction. That means that the artists have done research on how the light works and how the light reflects, also how it affects our eyes. I want to talk about this piece, Silence in Motion by Wilfredo Soto. When you look at this piece from a distance, you will see that maybe it's gray. As you get closer, you're gonna notice that there is this metallic um, piece strip onto it, it's, it's attached to it. You're gonna look at black and white lines across and then you're gonna see that the artwork starts vibrating. What I love about this piece is that these lines are actually not perfect. There is some imperfection to it that adds to the vibration and the more you focus on these the strip, the more it vibrates which actually resonates with the title, Silence in Motion. Mm -hmm. 